Hey there, kia ora my family, I've got another update for you here, so I just want to let you know a few things. The first one is that it is now school holidays here, so work is going to be very busy, so I'm going to be taking time away from making videos for the channel, just until school holidays is done, as my attention is going to be required fully at the workplace. So I do have a few projects in mind that I do want to put out, there's a few involving uh, Tekken and other games like that, and also another game I've been replaying recently, which got re-released for the PS4, and that was Saints Row the Third Remastered. So I'm looking forward to making a video using that game in any way I'm able to, not so sure what I'm going to do for it, but I was also contemplating doing a part 4 for my Recreating Impact, talking about Geese Howard, as Geese is one of my favourite characters, but the way I like to make those videos does take a lot of time, and during the school holiday period, I'm not going to be able to have all the time I need to do that. So I'm not going to be able to make any videos to the quality I want to at all during this time. So I will still be uploading frequently to Twitter, uh, little snippets here and there, uh, clips that I can throw together just to uh, uh, show off a few things and just to keep you updated there. But as for the channel, I'm going to be on hiatus for a little bit, uh, preferably for about two weeks, because that's how long school holidays typically go for. So anyone who's familiar with uh, me doing my videos around this time frame before will know that this is the point where I don't upload anything, really. I'll only upload like a little 10 second clip here and there. But as for doing anything major, I won't be uploading anything and the second thing I wanted to address, I'm pretty sure a lot of you have already been made aware of this, but uh, the fighting game community is in a little bit of shambles at the moment. Uh, a lot of really bad things have come to light, uh, and a lot of people are on edge about it, some are disgusted by it, and some are still trying to get by and enjoying their games and enjoying the love that the community has given them, like myself. So, despite the... Because, yeah, yeah, actually, yeah, before I continue, um, the one thing I have always said to myself and everyone else is that when it comes to communities and how they are perceived as toxic, uh, I've always said it's not the communities that are toxic, it's individuals within the community that make it toxic. And there has been one individual, not just the leader of a community, but I'm pretty sure all of you would have heard about it. It involves the CEO, or former CEO, of the Evolution fighting game tournament, and yeah, everything that has happened there, that has completely cancelled EVO, EVO is no longer happening, there was going to be an online EVO, but nope, the new CEO that has taken over, he saw that it was, the best thing to do was just to outright cancel it, so, despite all of that that has been happening, everyone is still trying to get by, and uh, they're all still trying to show support for the games they love, despite all the bad stuff that has happened. So, yeah, those are the things I just wanted to quickly address. Um, I'm going to be working my ass off throughout the school holidays, so I'm not going to be making really any videos. Um, and despite all the bad stuff that has happened within the FGC, I'm still going to be enjoying my fighting games. As you would have saw earlier in the video, I did have some clips of Tekken and Fatal Fury. So... I'm definitely not going to be giving up fighting games simply because of one bad, no, not one bad thing, multiple bad things, because we've been through hard times before, and we will get through it again. And another thing that I also wanted to very quickly talk about is that, uh, speaking of work, even before the holidays have started, it's really been messing up my schedule, and uh, by not just my video making schedule, but my sleeping schedule, and everything in between that, because I've had a lot of things to do, a lot of responsibilities I've had on my shoulders, and it does tend to be very taxing. Not so much physically, because I can handle the uh, physical stuff, I am quite strong when it comes to that, but it's a lot of the mental weight that I try and deal with. Long hours throughout the day, and picking up the slack for other people that just don't want to do the work, uh, that right there is what really gets me down. And... Me, just being a happy camper that loves his job and will do what he can, uh, I'm in a position where I can't really say too much. All I can do is just uh, go
go by the by and just get the mahi done. Mahi meaning work. But um, anyway, yeah, and another thing I wanted to say is that I hope everyone else out there is doing okay too. I understand there are still a few places dealing with uh, COVID lockdowns and uh, other things getting in the way of that, trying to prevent uh, spread of the virus. And uh, also with the Black Lives Matter movement that is happening, uh, I'm trying to show support for that as well. And um, I hope that a lot of you out there are doing the same thing, you know, because there are people that are saying, oh, you know, yeah, all lives matter. But uh, yeah, anyone who says that, fuck up. Uh, it's the black lives that have been in danger for the longest, and they are in danger right now. So that's why we say black lives matter. Not only black lives matter. Now, I'm not black, but I can show support for it because there's a lot of friends out there that I have that are black, and there's a lot of uh, content creators on YouTube, Twitter, Twitch that I like to show support for. And yeah, that's just. It's a very fucked up situation. Uh, 2020 is the year of everything fucking up. But the one thing we all need to remember is to... Is that, well, we need to heal. You know, we need to understand that eventually... You know, if we put in the effort... And we raise awareness for it... And we follow through on what we do with our support... Things will get better. Because that's what history has shown time and time again. Uh, healing and change will only happen when the bad shit comes to light and the ones who caused it suffer the consequences that's the only way things are going to change it's uh it's shit that it has to happen but it's the only way it's going to get better anyway i'm going to end my little uh update slash ramble right there so yeah so i'll end it there and i hope everyone stays safe uh and be happy too Man, that's another very important thing be happy everyone Okay, cool. I'll see you whenever I can when I put out the next video or whatnot or when I do another update later on, probably at the end of the school holidays. So cheer my whānau. Have a good one. Kakite.